Welcome back, ladies and gents, to some more Resident Evil 7 Part 5. I gotta say, I'm actually really enjoying myself with this game. Enjoying myself? Yeah, I think that's the right, correct pronunciation. Because I was worried, like I said at first, I'm like, uh, I don't know, because this doesn't seem like Outlast, Amnesia, and, you know, hold up. Okay, I don't have any chemical, whatchamacallits. But you gotta admit, it does, at first glance, you can't help but feel like this is, you know, Outlast and Amnesia like that. And they have taken some great pointers from those games, but you know, does feel like Resident Evil, I guess. But what is a Resident Evil game? I was just reading, uh, I just looked at this one IGN title saying, um, saying, it's Resident Evil 7. Does it feel like a Resident Evil? Oh, more herbs? Thank you. Shoot me, shoot me. Son. They said, does Resident Evil 7 feel, feel like a Resident Evil game? I'm like, sure, I guess, like, old school Resident Evil, I guess. I don't know, because I it's been years since I played the old school Resident Evil games. I think I only played 0, 2, and 3. I never beat 2 or 3. Yes, no, maybe so. Did I say that? Did I say that? Yeah, I never beat two or three. I think I beat zero, but I played part of four, but I watched, like, I know everything about Resident Evil 4, then I love Resident Evil 5, and, you know, 6 Leon's campaign is awesome. God, I honestly thought that was, like, someone hanging from there. Creep me out. But it's like the Final Fantasy argument. Like, what is a Final Fantasy game? Now, I did... Um, Final Fantasy 15 was my favorite game of 2016. Such a great game. Um, really great. Like, an 8.9 grade. Could have been amazing, but, you know, the story was good, but very ambitious. Could have been a lot more. But it's like, yeah, what... Oh, no. It got a lot darker in here. I'm turning down my headphone volume. So yeah, I don't know. What is a Final Fantasy game? What is a Resident Evil game? Because a lot of people like to be like, oh, Resident Evil 5, that's not like, that's not Resident Evil. That's far from Resident Evil. And same thing with 6. I'm like, well, that's not fair because Resident Evil 5 is the best-selling Resident Evil game if people, you know, People don't want to admit that it is the best selling and Resident Evil 6 is the second best selling Resident Evil game. And I think Resident Evil 4 is the third best selling Resident Evil game. So I'm like, there's a reason why 5 and 6 sold a lot and you can't like discredit them. But there are people who do like, was all that crap gunk there in the first place? I forgot. But you can't discredit, you know, all that success it had. Because I am a huge fan of five. Like I said, I. What? What? <sighs> How you doing? Ugh. I just lost my train of thought. You know what? I'm going to keep quiet for now. You guys get what I'm saying. Pretty much. Oh, I just noticed him. Oh, God, Jesus. thing to do is just close the door. Christ. Little bastard. Can't open it now, huh? Alright. But yeah, you guys get what I'm saying. Like, there are Resident Evil fans who do prefer the action-y stuff, which is, you know, awesome. I do like the action stuff in Resident Evil 
Some of it. Not most. Some of it. What did he say? Prove you're a real man. Stick your hand down the pig's throat. Where's his head? Wait, do I have... Oh, this pig? No. Hmm. Oh, I see. Sorry, buddy. Oh man, that was close. Far too close. Alright, now if I'm not mistaken, we're gonna have to do a lot of backtracking. You still can't go into the workshop, huh? I can tell that's going to be important. All right, we need to go back upstairs. First, I'm gonna save, of course. I'm gonna get my booty. God, Jesus! Well, this is really bad. I have two herbs, but I don't have any uh, chemical whatchamacallits. So we're going to save. In the first couple of parts, we passed by a lot of doors that had this snake uh, symbol on them. But I forgot where, they're, where they were. Oh, I hear some noises upstairs. Not in the game, in my apartment. The neighbors are getting rowdy. Oh, come on! God, I gotta save ammo. Alright, here's what we're gonna do. I'm not gonna lie to you guys. Probably gonna die a lot. So there's gonna be a lot of editing, a lot of weird cuts. Because yeah, for show. Sure, we're definitely gonna die a lot. Or I'm gonna die. You guys aren't gonna die. You're not playing with me. Or you guys can play. In some way. Would you like to play a game? God. I hate those movies. I mean, they're 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 scary because I'm a big baby and can't take horror stuff. God, Jesus, those Saw movies. There's something else. All right, let's go back and see if they're gone. Hopefully. I remember the one Saw movie. I forgot. what It was either Saw 2 or 3. At the end, the lady's uh, rib cage uh, she got ripped apart from her. I'm like, oh, my God. Sweet, they're gone. Yep, I take that back. We're going to have to do something about that. Okay, snake door right over there. Close. There we go. Mima, you need to stop creeping, lady. All 
That's going to come in handy. Like they say, the best offensive defense is to run. Who's this? Okay, I got three herbs. Shotgun shells, that's going to come in handy. Who's this guy? He has great glasses. Jack joins the Marines in 1980. Huh. I remember the 80s, even though I was born in 95. Uh, what else? <sighs> the same time as all the other clocks. The same time as all the other clocks, huh? Have we have passed by some clocks, right? Thank you. I have four herbs, but I have nothing to mix them with. Give me something, please. Treasure photo. I've yet to find one treasure yet. Yet. Did that make sense? What is this? Uh oh. Okay, we have to do something with that clock over there. It says the same time as the other clocks. Is that what it says? The same time as the other clocks. Okay. Hmm. All right, I think I have an idea. And in the interest of time, we are back. I figure out what to do. That's creepy. Uh, we have to set the time to what the grandfather clock says on the main house or the guest house. So, um, take it back. There we go. 10.15. Oh, Christ, I just noticed that. Oh, yeah. Making sure I'm not missing anything else. Let's go. <sighs> Come on, Lucas. What you got for Papa? I, mean, I didn't mean to say that, but what you got for me? I definitely don't want you to be your damn dad. Oh, boy. Man, all you people are freaking nuts in here. And yes, I do mean you people. You're bad-ish insane. Got one. Alright. One more key card to go. Now, since I've had it, or since I got it, something's gonna pop out and we're gonna have to fight it. Oh, yeah, I feel it. Oh, we're in the workshop. All right, the dissection room is that way. Let's go back upstairs. Christ. I forgot I left these guys behind. I forgot there was a shortcut this way. Let's hurry. Whew. That was close. Alright, let's go back and save and find that other key card, shall we? Man, I'm not looking good. We really need to find some chemical whatever. All right, let's go find that blue key card. 
trying to dodge the emotes at the same time. At the same damn time on the phone. Cooking, cooking. All right, come on. Here it is. Here I am. I got a bad feeling. All right. Hey, being kids' rooms like this creeps me out. Oh, boy. Uh, excuse me. Had to belch. Thank you for that. It's definitely going to come in handy. What? This ball doesn't do anything huh surprised we can't go under there supplements yeah oh another lock pick yes sir wait did I pick it up yeah Make sure I got everything before we ascend. Ascension. Ascension. Did I say that right? I reread that. Nothing here. What is this? Nothing. Okay. Well, all right. I would run back and go down. Uh, go back downstairs, but. Oh wait, hold on. Okay, never mind. I think I search everywhere to see if there's any chem fluid. Oh man, this is gonna be creepy. Alright, before we do that, let's search around this place a little bit. Oh, strong chem fluid. That's why I want it. <sighs> we gotta drop something. All right, I unlocked this thing to get the blue key card, but here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna go back to where we watched the Mia videotape. Watch this happy birthday one, drop this one off. Then we'll do like a quick edit and go save. 
We're going to have to be fast about this, too. Okay, let's close this door. Close this door. Close that door. All right, we should be safe. Some a bitch. You know, I, I actually envy you. What? You don't believe me? <laughs> this joy? Well, you can't fake this. It has taken me weeks to finish this, and it is finally ready. And it's all for you. Oh, oh come on now. Don't be like that. It's gonna be fun. Just you wait. I'd really like to make it out of this room alive and not die a horrible, painful death. I know. It's a temp title. Take a candle, light it, and put it on the cake. And remember to smile. This party is for you. <laughs> Fuck you. Disgusting.
fuck is this? What are you doing? What are you doing? Oh, man. No. No. Happy birthday! Boom! We finally got the blue key card. Took a lot longer than I wanted to, but I wanted to play that birthday uh, VHS tape. Very creepy at the end. Just like the rest of the game. Very creepy. Alright, do we have to go fight Lucas now? I'm actually not that ready because I have barely any bullets. I have one med kit. Like that uh, Margaret boss fight? Uh oh. Uh -oh. Let me talk to Mia. No, no, no! You gotta show up first! You haven't forgotten where the party is, have you? You can get in from the courtyard. So come on, man! Everybody's waiting for you! All right. Oh, come on! Jesus Christ. Hopefully I didn't say that too loud. Or these mother efforts are everywhere. Okay, there's one. God, Jesus, they're like liquors. I really don't want to use them ammo, but might as well.
Oh, man. Whoop, might as well use it. What the hell? yolo in out right now. Let's save again. <laughs> okay. No medkits now, but I do have a lot of herbs. Blue. Red. I got four herbs. All right. That'd be cool if he start, starts playing some Skrillex. I haven't listened to one of his songs in a while. <laughs> 